Lucky's wheels and deals back. At it again. About to put this cold air intake on here. I haven't seen a video on YouTube on it. So how to bypass, especially with the newer ones because the 2016 and 17, I'm not sure about the 15, but I know the 14 did not have this. So we wanna... It's too bad it's hot as a mofo. Yeah, I just pulled up on it. You know, I had to hit like, had it 120 or something. No. I wasn't going that fast. <laughs> it didn't take you very long to get back. Yeah. We in Mexico. <laughs> right? But yeah, we're going to install this cold air intake that I got. I Woo! Boy, eBay. that is rough. eBay special. Got cold air intake. I got to get the red one. Actually, I didn't have a choice. They didn't have no other one, but I started thinking about like the red matches the black. I'm gonna just keep that like that. Came with all my hoses and clamps. There's a whole bunch of clamps in here. Like that. Some more rubber. I got pipe and some rubber. <laughs> Got the heat shield for when things get hot. Yep, yeah, we're gonna install this. I'm gonna turn it apart. Yes, I'm using the wrong tools, but that's all right. Still got it off there, didn't I? <laughs> Looking so clean and shiny. Keep your fucking comments to yourself. That shit looks shiny. Yeah, it's brand fucking new. What do you, it should be. <laughs> Have to squeeze and pull like so. It's got a little, not for the faint of heart. It's definitely not easy to get off. You gotta squeeze it. And you do this with your hand, huh? Yeah, you do it with your hand. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what it looks like. So it's just that little hole. Oh, yeah. Now, we're gonna go ahead and- Intake, what do they call it? The intake sound tube. Sound? Oh, to put it inside the car? Yeah. Oh, you hear that? Damn the, sense. They, I don't know. They, I guess they hear the motor or they hear the intake the sucking. Intake. Yeah, or no something. I don't sense. know. So we're gonna go down. We're gonna plug that. Plug After it. After we put some cold air intake on it, we are gonna be able to hear that. Yeah. You gotta worry about all that bullshit. Hell yeah. Look how clean that motor is, Lucky. Clean. Looks I don't good. think I never power wash this motor. I, and I Dude. always power wash. I Go always power. power wash this one. Oh, you know I got to. You got to, right? You know me, I got to. I'm OCD about power washing motors. Look at this. This car is so new, the motherfucking air filter is still factory. Look at that shit. Ain't even no dust. Yeah. Brand new air filter. Clean. Put this shit over here. The rest of the parts. 10,000 miles now. I bought it. With low, 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 low. <laughs> low, low. Look at all that air now. How much air is going to flow in there? Mm -hmm. So much better. Man. That air flow. We got these little. This is a little sound too. Man, that's gonna breathe really good, Lucky. You said what? That's gonna breathe really good. Yeah. You see, it's got a catch right down there. You can see where the air scoops in. Oh. Oh, that's it's got a scoop. Car's gonna breathe real good. Hell yeah. 
All right, we're back on this uh, SS. Still working on it. I want to let you guys know a couple of things you need to take off, a couple of things that'll come in the box. You do not need, there's going to be a rubber plug about yay big around, about that big. Fits perfect in the hole. Get in there so you can see it, yeah. Fits perfect on the inside of the hole. Uh -huh. It should keep it from having air Oh, issues. so it did come with something. Yeah, it come with a rubber plug. You just stuff it in there. Okay. And then... Okay, so a couple of things you're gonna have to take off, a couple of things you're gonna need to know to look for. There's a bolt right here. There's a little tiny bracket and there's a bolt. You need to take that bolt loose so you can bolt this to it. And then there's a bolt over here. Whenever you take the air box out of it, you're gonna bolt this down right here. I actually put this bolt backwards, I think, but it should be all right because we're gonna have this held down really well. I'm probably gonna run back in and put some rubber down underneath this this one did not come oh it did come with rubber so i'm gonna put this rubber on it that'll keep it from bouncing or anything like that it's easy to put on you can put it on while it's still in the car also there is a hose that runs right here runs across the top it comes right over here save this for future reference if you ever need it but other than that it's coming off you're not gonna clamp it. There's not any clamps or anything. You're gonna get this piece of rubber right here. A replacement. Yeah. Okay. Just it's just a vent for the motor. It goes in there. It has to be hooked up. Must be hooked up. 100% must be hooked up because if it's not hooked up, the motor will not run right. Okay. That sucks motor uh, the air out of the motor. Okay. Also, it hooks up right here. Yeah, it hooks up right there. Yeah. Right there. Okay. Also, you see how I did that, Spectre. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got it. Got it hooked up properly. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And I'll have it all run through there here in just a few minutes. So, but yeah, let me go ahead and get this put on here and we'll come back with a little bit more update here in a few minutes. All right. So after careful consideration, decided we did have to pull the box back out of it. Um, you got some, so this is some rubber that just keeps it from flopping making any noises or anything like that and runs all along here so i did pull it back out it's just a single 10 millimeter bolt here and uh i think that's a um, 25 t25 to take out this bolt right here not terribly difficult super duper um easy to be completely honest um and then we'll give you guys another update here in just a minute i'm gonna get the rubber boot put on here get the the neck put across and we'll get the filter put on it. So here in a few minutes, you guys will get a update. Boom. Yep, it's gonna yeah. go just like that. Not a hundred percent sure. Oh, I see what happened. Okay, all right. So we're gonna do this. And then we're gonna do... You guys are figuring it out with us today. Look at this. Yeah. So that's gonna be like that. And then we're gonna do this. This is like playing with Legos, James. You pretty much. Playing with Legos. Like a Legos without a fucking instruction manual. How about that? There yeah. ain't no instruction manual in that box. <laughs> so I assume, assuming, you know what they say, assuming's for assholes. Three, three clamps. There. getting there not quite you got that's kind of upside down right now but i was just trying to test fit it to try to get the spectra the proper direction there, there yeah i want to make sure it's the proper direction because you know we don't do anything half-assed around here not on my shit either <laughs> right okay no 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 nope, that don't go through there it well, don't go we'll through go it right there next oh that one it goes like that on the other side of it like so and then that's what holds it and i guess you'd probably put it like that would be my best bet that way you have good airflow should be good airflow right there yeah. so this is the updated version make sure you show them your wife's because hers is the old version this is the new version yeah. and we ain't got it tight yet but you can kind of see where we're going here there it says the, on hers the l shape is longer 
Yeah, hers comes, comes right around here. bigger. Oh, it comes more. Okay. Let's see. Let's go over there. I thought it was the same. Basically now, we're just gonna make sure it's nice and pushed up, and I'm gonna go through, put all the bracket, or, you know, all the clamps on it, and then I'll tighten it down. That shit looking right. I need to go get me an engine cover. Give me an engine cover with the black and the red to match all this. Oh, it's this shit pop. is clean. You, you are gonna get the engine cover, like we see? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna order it. Yeah, that's gonna be clean. When I get time to stop running around trying to make money, busting moves and shit, but. I had to put this on. I had it in the in my trunk for the last three days. So the difference between hers and yours. <laughs> You're saying three days like that was forever. I mean, shit. <laughs> we could have been put this on. It don't take that long to put this on, but yeah. shit. The difference is, is hers comes way out here and uh -huh. it comes back. And it only is two pieces Yeah. with the intake right here. Yours has the flex because whenever you give it gas, the motor moves. So you want this to flex instead of pulling on it. We've already noticed her filter fell off once. Oh, I see. That's why. why it's like that. That's what I was explaining. That's a better version of it. That's why oh. it has this flex right here because her filter fell you know, off. I like that. That's a different, that's why they did it like that. Also, if you look at hers, hers has, um, the hole is in the middle. Yours has the hole to where it comes up and then it forces the air back into it like that. Let me see Start it up. I gotta shut the hood. Oh, yeah. Make sure it sit down flush. Start it up with the cold air intake. And this is my second mod. Melly, get in there and give me some revs. Alright, watch. Right right here. Rev it up. That's why they did that. Uh, do it again, Melly. Get by the pipes. It sounds right. Next step. Flow master. Long yeah. tube headers and flow master. Long tube headers and flow master. Yeah. Make sure you guys like, share, comment, subscribe. Lucky's Wheels and Deals, and I'm out. Peace.